Hi and welcome to this video. In this video we'll be talking about a useful little utility called Auto Start Explorer. Now you can get this program or utility from this website, it's uh, Michelle um, Internet Security and basically this is the web address here. I will put the link up in my description. Okay and it's only a small little application so just click on the download tab there and basically uh, as you can see it's 221 KB it's only a small little application and uh, it will come down in this little zip file like that make a little folder on your desktop or wherever you want to make it call it wherever you like I've called mine Auto, Auto Start Explorer open up this drag these four files in inside that folder there and you're pretty much good to go like so okay now this is the actual application I said now I've scanned it and everything else, it's all pretty much clean, there's nothing wrong with it. Uh, there's no spyware embedded in it. There's no exit there's no actually installation that you need to do with this file. So it's going to be great for running on a USB stick or something of that nature, okay? Um and it's going to be great for tracking down Trojans, viruses, spyware, and even just checking out your your startup menu and what's going on in there as well. Okay, so let's get started anyway. We're going to double click on this uh, icon here. I know this is not the normal icon for an executable file. Uh, it's more of a DLL uh, sort of icon but hey it still works and uh, just click on that and up she comes let's have a little quick look at what we got here as you can see we've got the registry keys that you can actually uh, troll through and uh, as you can see we've got um, little, you can actually open up folders as well you can see the actual folder icon there so if I wanted to open the folder up for this icon here just click on open folder and it will actually open the folder up which I thought was pretty handy and especially if it's uh, the location where that file is also you've got system 32 it'll open up the file file that file in that area in that folder as you can see system 32 it's gone straight in there it's going to help you um, get rid of those uh, nasties that you may have on your system okay so let's have a little look at um, the startup folder there's not much on this system it's a pretty much bare bones system really to be honest there's not much on there uh, it's just not long been formatted and uh, let's have a little look at some of the uh, services you've got a service applica uh, applications here which is pretty useful as you can see this is a uh, Komodo internet security you can actually open up the folder there okay you can also do a properties search on the uh, on the actual files itself right click and go properties okay and uh, have a look at the folder and go through I mean that's alone is pretty handy as well and you've also got the checking the uh, system files as you can see there system root system 32 drivers and uh, system files so you can have a look there uh, through them there sometimes as you will know trojans and whatnot use these types of files to uh, hide their nasty viruses and stuff like that okay so if you've got them in there you can actually root them out there you know where they are and you can see them and you can actually delete them okay which is going to make it a lot more easier okay so some of these when they don't work like this when it doesn't open the folder that's because obviously it's it's not an application or something of that nature it's just an actual uh, file that's running in there okay so we can have a, a little look here um, some of them are greyed out because obviously you can't do properties as you can see you can actually have a little investigate and see what it is okay so anyway, I hope this has been some use to you. I mean, I found this uh, uh, on Laker Coolman's uh, YouTube channel, and I thought it'd be handy to add to my little collection of uh, computer-related videos. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel, show your support. Any questions, post a comment or send me a private message, and I'll do my best to answer that question for you. Any requests for videos, by all means, send me a message and I'll do my best to make that video for you as long as it's computer related. Okay, my name is Brian from brightech.co.uk. Thanks very much for watching. Bye for now.